The force of energy and strength that is standing in that ring at this moment is one of the most terrifying figures that's ever been in WWE. This one could be the match of the night. Just making his presence felt there. You could call this a good old fashioned butt whooping. Yeah, that's exactly what we're witnessing. A butt whooping. And uh oh, looking at Randy Orton. What's the story for him right now? What can you tell the WWE Universe about Ryback? Oh, the longer Orton's in control of this match, the more dangerous it becomes. Ryback is a great champion, and even though there's no title at stake here, I expect great things from him tonight. Say what you will about Randy Orton, and most people have plenty to say, but there can be no doubt that he is one of the most ruthless performers in WWE. Oh, forget about ruthless, Michael. I'd go so far as to call him merciless. I mean, when we see the Viper get that demented grin on his face and an opponent in a vulnerable position, we know that things are bound to get a little nasty. A counter by Ryback. Yeah, Ryback's proving he's more than just muscle. Inside the ring now. Finally, let's get this done inside the ring. Look out. Randy Orton, a victim of his own dirty deeds. And if we're going to talk nasty when it comes to Randy Orton, I'll never forget the night on Raw when the Apex Predator gave the Miz one of the worst beatdowns I've ever seen right in front of Miz's parents. That was downright cruel, but Randy seemed to enjoy every last minute of it. He goes for the quick pin attempt. Kill. And the shoulder's up in time. Well, as long as it's up before that three count, that's all that matters. Ryback refuses to give up. At this point, you think he'd have that move well scouted. All oh, the Vipers locked in. Randy's hearing the voices in his head. This is how he gets that focus, that strength. The Viper can dial up that intensity whenever he chooses. Well, King, just like you said, the cruelty factor is always high in a Randy Orton match. The Apex Predator hears voices, and I'm not sure what they're saying to him, but I know they're not telling him to play nice in the sandbox. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Oh, he missed. Oh, -ho, nobody home that time. Look at him unloading with the Daz Press. No, not again. I'm getting tired just watching Ryback. And there's the reversal. Oh, wait, nice reversal. And he fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was some miss, all right. I could feel the breeze all the way over here. Just look at this. You can see the results from that move. Look at this head time. Incredible. You know, if the WWE fans know one thing, it's that Randy Orton is one of the most lethal supers. Hoping to end it early. Here's Hope. And he escapes with a kick out. Randy Orton refuses to lose here tonight. When he gets going like this, there are few better. Boy, did he get dropped or what? He's setting it up. Great match here, but if you missed any of the matches from this week, go to WWE.com to catch up on all the action. I go to WWE.com all the time to catch up on the Divas. King, you talked about the fans and Randy Orton. Let me tell you, Randy Orton doesn't give two, quote, you know what, about the fans. Well, you did say something I do agree with, however. With every step the Viper takes in his way to the ring, he is plotting. Orton is shoulders down, and he breaks the cover, forcing the referee to stop the count. Well, that's just not enough to get the job done. What do you have to do to keep this guy down? He delivers another elbow. Another and another. How many more of these can he deliver? 
full clutch applied. And man, is he pulling back on that neck. Not today, too fast. Oh, a serious knockout blow. It's very clear that when fans see Randy Orton, they know danger is about to make its presence felt. The crowd watches Orton very carefully to see what he's going to do. They are trying to anticipate the unknown, trying to figure out just when the apex predator is going to strike. Well, WWE fans have watched Randy Orton for a long time now, and they've seen the pain and damage that he inflicts on an opponent. They know that Randy's a physical and psychological beast when it comes to what goes on in that ring and knowing what it takes to defeat an opponent. That's got to be it, Randy Orton. How about that finishing move? That phased him. I mean, there's no way it couldn't have. He's setting it up. Good Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. The shoulders are down. And a kick out. And that's all that matters. This match continues. There's no keeping this guy down tonight. I think everyone would agree that in a relatively brief amount of time, Ryback's made some history. The devastating three stages of hell match Ryback had with John Cena at Payback 2013 was so brutal, some people described it as a human car wreck. Look out. Ryback turns the tide. Well, that's one way of getting out of trouble. And he lets him out. Well, he might have been losing some of his grip there anyway. He probably figured it would be better to release the hole now before his opponent could counter it. Can he score the pin? And a kick out. Uh, the kick out's all that's saving. This match goes on. Oh, uh, there is no quit in this man tonight. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. An elbow. Whoa. A direct. And there's the release. What's going to happen now? Here's the cover. And he kicks out. And he lives to fight again. Oh, man. Orton's so dangerous. I mean, just when you think you have him down, he gets right back up. We're witnessing a merciless assault. No mercy whatsoever. Folks, we're in Rosemont tonight, a city that has hosted several WrestleManias, including the second leg of WrestleMania II. Orton gets caught off guard. You can practically feel the wear and tear that's been done throughout this match. Nice move. Oh, what a shot. That did some serious damage. You can't take too many of those and expect to be in the match much longer. What a reversal! Quick thinking to avoid that. What's he gonna do here? What's he gonna do here? And we're back to this form of attack. Yes, we are. The same form of attack we've seen before. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. Oh, why? He's wild in there. Hey, this may very well be it. Two. Win. 